Uh, guys, if I'm being honest here, this whole God for Ragnarok situation, um, I'm just kind of done. <laughs> like, I know people would probably want me to talk about this. Oh my God, Jir, the snitch said this. Did Jir, just your Shrider said this. Guys, I'm just going to be real here. We'll see God for Ragnarok when we see God for Ragnarok. Okay? I mean, that's just the fact. We will see this game when we see it. And honestly, I, um, <laughs> I'm kind of more worried about people's hype levels for this game. Because it's like, everywhere I go, I'm literally checking Twitter right now as I record this. Everywhere I go, I literally see people just constantly talking about, it. oh, this, oh, that. Uh, bah, bah, uh, bah, bah. It's like, guys, just, just chill. Just chill your horses, please. I, I know you guys want this game. I want this game. But at the same damn time... I've always been a firm believer in that, uh, what's that freaking old quote? A delayed game is definitely good. A rush game is forever bad. So I forget who made that quote, but it's true. And if you ever want to see proof of that, just look at Cyberpunk. <laughs> That's an example of both. <laughs> but far as like anything, I guess you would say newsworthy. I guess this is kind of news, so we'll just, I'll read this out loud. Dear all. If you were, it were up to me, I would share all the information I know about it, but it's not up to me. So please be patient. I promise things will be shared at the earliest possible moment they can be. We make games for you. We make games cause, because of you. That's from Corey Barlog. And, yeah, that's what I want to say here, guys. Just patience. You need to learn it. I know you're excited for God for Ragnarok, but man, oh, man... Some of you guys are taking this shit to new extremes where, like, apparently developers are constantly getting, like, notifications spammed. There are people out there who apparently might have received some kind of, you know, vague mafia-style threats. Like, you better give us a guy for a Ragnarok release date or just saying that nice office of yours. Be ashamed if something bad happened to it. I don't, I don't know if like, people are doing that, but you know how crazy people are. I wouldn't throw out the realm of possibilities. And it's just, uh, why are people like this? Like I said, I'm excited for God War Ragnarok, but it's not the end of the world for me if this thing is just, you know, it takes a little bit longer. I say we got till September to hear about the release date, then. After that, I'm going to assume it's delayed. That's my promise on this. And even as recent as Jason Schreier has said that he did hear earlier this month and more recently that it was still planned to have some kind of reveal on the 30th. But the problem with that is now with Corey Barlock pointing out that tweet that kind of implies that maybe that's not happening anymore. I don't know, guys. God for Ragnarok could literally come out on Christmas fucking day and people would still just be overly excited. But guys, control your hype levels. Until next time, guys, this is That PlayStation Gamer signing out. I hope y'all have a good day. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and all that YouTube algorithm BS. I'm more excited for The Last of Us Part 1, if I'm being honest. But that's just me being a Last of Us shell. Have a good day.